Okay, we'll let's just take it easy. What's up you guys? It is Friday and I got Joey over here and I have Shelby with me over there and we're gonna go ride some bikes. So yeah, let's go do that. Like right now. Like this instant. Like Shelby, get 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 on your bike. Let, like stop messing with your Joey! Be civilized. We're we're in public. I'll be good, I promise. Alright guys, we have no idea where we're going, what we're doing. We're just riding, we're having a good time. Oh. <laughs> oh, I know every once in a while you want to know what a real bike feels like, Joey. Like, all the way left, right? All the way left. The highway! Oh, you're excited. Oh, you're excited you're going highway. Guys, my Dixer's excited. Oh my god, Van. What are you doing? What speed are you comfortable at? Okay. 185, got it. Is there anyone behind us? Yeah. Okay. I need to like really practice like cornering. Like that is like my next chapter. It's not like trying to do wheelies or anything like that. It's like learn how to actually handle the bike. How you doing Shelby? Okay. Well, this this is a decreasing radius turn, so watch out. This is how you wreck your Dixif. Stop it. Another decreasing radius turn. Ooh, this is a this is a nice sweeper. Yeah, just take it at your own pace, Shelby. Don't push it. Where do we want to stop at? In the Sonic, I guess? Ah. Uh, yeah, that sounds interesting. Um, I can find, like, I haven't taken the Jigstron Twisty yet. Uh, Twisties yet. And so, like, 
And I wouldn't really consider these like super twisty, but like still a ton of fun. Yeah. Yeah. But right now that I would not take a I would not consider going hard on it. Those those at least on the side that we just went on was like super uneven. Yeah, no, no, it was great. Like I had I had great time. Um I just need more practice. Alright guys, well we just chilled for a minute after hitting uh, this twisty-ish road and uh, we decided not going to take the twisty road back because it is kind of sketchy and uh, there was a a Dodge being angry in line at Sonic so we're going to we're going to head back on the highway and find something else to do. Did we? Did you just floss? <laughs> Alright, we're now going down the deadly road. <laughs> but I want to live! Alright guys, well, so... We, we hit a twisty road, it was a lot of fun, but it was kind of sketchy and people were kind of driving crazy on it and uh, Shelby is still kind of a new rider and I don't want to make her too uncomfortable so we decided that we're going to not take the twisty windy road back and we're going to be hitting the highway back. We're going to try to find something else to do and that's kind of like one of the things I like to kind of stress. If you're not comfortable doing something, don't do it. If you're in a group ride and they are not willing to respect that that's not something you're comfortable enough doing, uh, find new people to ride. Uh, that, that or break off. Go find something else to do. Because there's no point in putting your life in danger just to stay with a group. Exit right here. Um, yeah, de oh wow, lot very decreasing radius right here. Like, uh, oh, that's Shelby. I was like, who's passing us? Oh my gosh, she's hauling ass. I'm comfortable at 80, 85. Goes 110. All right, Joey, third gear. Third gear. Oh, dude, this guy's drunk. Be careful. Don't, don't, stay on this lane, stay on this lane. Yeah. Where to now? Was that you, Revan? Yeah, 
y'all want to stop here at the church for a little bit or what y'all want to do? Oh, dude, I want to take a picture of the... I gotta get a thumbnail. I did not expect you to fly by me at 100 miles per hour, like at all. So like, I'm there, I'm chilling, listening to music, I'm having a great, fantastic time. I'm like, hey, there's a bike that, that's Shelby. <laughs> and I, you, you can probably pick it up in the video, me saying that. I'm like, cat ears are going 100 miles per hour. That was fantastic. Man, everybody else is missing out. It's been a really nice ride tonight. been really nice tonight. Yes. So nice. Very nice. But they don't understand. <laughs> it's just <What>? the shall we go across. Uh, this is what I enjoy the most is like it's not just the writing but it's like the breaks and just hanging out and talking and uh, getting a complete lesson in uh, hentai stickers. And of all sorts, of all sorts, but culture. It's culture, yeah. It's culture. Oh, cop. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't originally gonna sticker bomb it, but we're, we're already there. Yeah. yeah. You you said you weren't going to, but like you did it like the first day. I did. <laughs> yep. So you're like, oh well, I guess I could never sell this bike. <laughs> No, I need to give it a good wash. Both the Jigsaw and the Grom need a good bath. I might do that tomorrow. But, yeah. To adventure! Woo! Uh. Uh. So, which way are we headed? What are we doing? Roundabout, roundabout. Okay, more roundabouts. I'm Mardo GP! Come down from the Apex! Get in the exit! Go for the upshift! Bye. Bye, Joey! You too! Wow, we did like 68 miles already. Yeah. Look at you one handing. Shelby, you've like come so far from when you started riding. You're doing good. Yeah, definitely. But uh, don't get overconfident, but you, you, you've come such a long way. I'm very proud of you. You got the zoomies there? Yeah, they're very, uh, they're very addicting. All right, well, make it home safe. Take care. <laughs> All right, well, look at bye. All righty. That was fun. All right, so we got to hit some twisties, which was a ton of fun. Uh, ooh. Um, was a lot of fun. I need a, man, I need a track, I really need to do a track day. I am dying to go and do a track day. Um, I don't think it'll be in the cards for this year, but I'm definitely going to prep prep up for next year. I think it'll be a lot of fun. But I, I'm definitely getting a lot more comfortable on the Jigsaw, which is it was always good. I'm, I'm full throttling it. I'm 
leaning in. I'm trying to figure out body positioning. And that that's my next step. Not not like doing fast boy stuff. I want to really learn like body positioning and get that dialed in. I think to me right now is more important and just how handling the bike in general and feeling comfortable uh, out in the corners. I think is probably the better better way of going about it. But everybody kind of broke off. It's like 11 o'clock. Uh, it might even be earlier than that. It's like maybe 10.30. Uh, Shelby and I went and did a little highway run just for a little bit. Joey went home. Uh, Shelby wasn't ready to call it quits yet. I kind of wasn't. I still can am not. Um, I need to do a solo ride. I think a solo ride would be good for me. Uh, cause like, I don't know, I'm kind of like a social rider. I really, like I'll ride solo on the way to work, but I rather, you know, I, like if I'm, I'm doing it recreationally, I'd rather be doing it during, with, with a group of friends. Cause I just want to, I just want to share, have that ability to share it. What do you guys prefer? Why don't y'all comment down below? Let me know. Do you guys prefer like group riding with friends? Not like the group group rides. I, I avoid those like the plague. But like, you know, riding with a couple of uh, friends or just riding solo. Or maybe with like one, just one, one other friend. Yeah, why don't you guys comment down below? Let me know. Do you guys prefer group rides or, you know, riding by yourself? Just chilling by yourself. Uh, I need to do a couple a couple of solo runs just to kind of get a feel you know it's been it's been 10 years i i haven't you know i'm going back into it i'm trying to gain more skills than when i left motorcycle when i left riding motorcycles that's that's uh that's what i'd like to do i think i'm gonna i think i'm gonna start searching for twisty roads so it's going to be very hard to do here in Texas, especially in suburbia that we are in, or the city that we are in. Because um, growing up around this place, this is like the only twisty, ro the twisty road I knew. And it's, you know, it's, it's just a nice big sweeper and it's not really twisty per se. understand what I got to do to actually get this front wheel up which is nice there's still little baby wheelies And I've yet to find a road where I can like freely practice these without it bothering or hindering everybody because I usually try to stay as far away as traffic as I possibly can. Maybe I should do a video of me just trying to find a place to go practice wheelies at. Maybe I should do that. Ah. Cause I need to do that. Oh man, I love this thing so much. 
It's literally the perfect street bike, in my opinion. You can agree to disagree or, or disagree to disagree. I don't even care. Um, this is a nice big open parking lot. I could practice probably a little bit of low speed maneuvers, which is what I need to do. Um, I think it's kind of the essential of being a good rider is uh, being able to do like low speed maneuvers. Getting, getting comfortable with your bike. Because anybody can go down the highway and, you know, haul ass. But there's a lot of people that get their bike and they can't full lock turn around. Like they can't, they can't like turn it around in the parking lot. Which is, is weird. And, and that's, it's all like, in my opinion, it's like, it's just getting, getting, you know, familiar with your motorcycle. Get familiar with it. That's all I'm saying. Let's see. How many parking spots can I turn this thing around? Are we gonna go MSF course on us on ourselves here? I don't think I don't think the uh, the turning radius on this thing is good enough. Now I'm like full locked. Hey, we're going into the <laughs> we're going into the the third spot. Uh, say love you. Whew. Oh, she's cooking. She's up to 222. As long as it doesn't go above 220, yeah, it's going back down. Fans kicked on. That's good. Yeah. Uh, anyways, guys, that's gonna. I'm gonna end it right here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I'm I'm spent for the night. It's been a stressful week at work. It's been rough. It's uh, you know we've had like the past weeks and a half. It's been you know constant rain. Uh, work has been absolutely just ridiculously busy and I just need to I just need to go ahead and uh, get past it all so I can go back to riding this beautiful thing and there's a cricket right there but yeah I'll have more content for you guys coming coming here shortly and thank y'all so much and I'll see you on the next one bye bye oh and hit hit the like button hit the subscribe button hit the the bell icon do do all the funny things that everybody does or don't do them don't worry about it if you don't want to um i'll still be pumping out content regardless so i'll see you guys on the next one Bye bye